Welcome to a meditation for healing the type nine in each of us. In this meditation, we will connect with the sacred essence of type nine and learn how to embody the power of universal harmony. True harmony is the medicine for the part of us that avoids living in our fullness, that avoids our own power, our own intensity, the part of us that feels like if we really were to fully come in and take up space and have a strong voice and strong opinions, that our full existence would destroy our relationships, disconnect us from the people we love, and drive us further from our beloved essence of harmony. Of course, this is based on a belief of harmony and an experience of feeling a taste of harmony only when we diminish our own self from the picture. And so in this meditation, we will learn to find true harmony, a harmony that includes us as full individuals, a harmony that includes all the expressions so that any discomfort, any intensity, even the appearance of disconnection is held by this harmony. And there is nothing that we can do to diminish the power of true harmony. So let's begin to settle in now. Take a couple deep breaths and prepare for a deep journey of healing the traits of type nine. Gently guide your attention now toward your body, beginning with the top of your head, just noticing your face, the back of your head, the sides of your head, and gather your awareness as much as you can in your head, finding your brain, inviting your brain to relax, inviting your conscious mind to rest in the background, and all your neural pathways to soften, becoming more and more relaxed, knowing it is safe to let go, it's good to let that thinking mind slow and relax and open so that you can hear this meditation and take it in through your senses. No need to think about it or analyze it or judge it. Allowing that part of your mind to soften. And find your presence becoming heavier, your awareness becoming heavier, like a soft pool of water. We're going to invite your awareness to sink down from the top of your head, past your brain, past your face, your eyes and your nose and your mouth down the back of your tongue, your awareness flows like water, slowly and gracefully draining down, down your throat, sinking into your shoulders, your awareness, and down into your heart center, down your arms, down past your hands and your palms. And as your awareness slowly flows downward, the space that it leaves behind is soft and open and empty. And it feels good to let your awareness sink lower now, down through your chest, through your heart center, down your back, flowing down your spine gently, slowly, easily, down into your ribs. This awareness finds your lungs and your breath 
deepening your breath, letting it be softer yet deeper. Let your awareness drop down through your ribs, through all the organs in your ribs and down into your stomach, your digestive tract, your upper belly and your lower belly, all the way down into your sacral below your belly button, your awareness softly sinking, softly flowing down, down your back all the way to the tip of your tailbone, the base of your spine, down into your root, your hips, through your perineum, down past your hips to your legs, upper legs and knees, down past your calves and your ankles, all the way down into your feet and even through the bottoms of your feet. And your awareness has sunk down through your whole being, leaving you deeply relaxed, grounded, anchored, deep within yourself, you're ready now to explore your gut center, your power center more deeply than ever before. Through the core orientation, the type nine, universal harmony and oneness. So find the center of your gut you might experience it as the face of your gut, a large part of your gut, a doorway or a threshold below your belly button, above your root. And begin to experience this part of your body extending down and stretching out on all sides. Feel an energy and picture the boundaries of the base of your body connecting with the floor, with the ground, with the earth and extending and stretching out infinitely on all sides so that your own gut, your own base and the ground of your own body is merging with the ground in your room and the ground outside of your room, your city, your country, spreading out to include the whole world just as though the floor is always beneath us, even though it changes material and setting, it is always the same floor under our being. Your gut is merging with this one continuous ground which becomes the surface of the earth. And you might feel like the whole earth is in your own gut or as if your own gut is stretching out to include the whole earth. Very spacious, very solid undifferentiated, this huge globe, this vast ground of being. And on this ground includes all the forms, the expressions of life, 
It's a huge, infinite spectrum of experiences, life situations, possibilities. It's all happening on the same of connected, continuous ground. And this ground is emanating from your own gut. And with this deep, direct experience of the whole earth, all of humanity happening within your gut, notice that every experience within humanity is happening at the same time on the same ground that there are experiences of people merging in love and people separating in pain happening at once all on the same ground of your being notice that the sense of groundedness of oneness is so strong when we sense into the ground, when we spend time noticing there is one ground equally holding all these diverse experiences and that there is one ground that stays solid beneath us while we are peacefully relaxing in our homes and one ground that stays solid beneath us while we are out fighting in the streets it is always the same harmonious ground holding us equally this solid ground is allowing and supporting every expression in humanity and it cannot be diminished by any way that you express your own self. This ground will be beneath you, supporting you in every phase of your life however you express yourself when you are angry when you are taking up space and when your voice and your opinions are strong imagine a time in your life when you were upset with someone you love and they were upset with you imagine feeling angry at someone and someone feeling angry at you picture what was happening in your minds what was coming out of your mouths what you did say and what you wanted to say and at the same time notice that the ground is harmonious under both of you while this is happening And no matter what you said to each other, you were both still held by this solid, harmonious ground beneath your bodies. Spend some time in your life sensing into this solid ground of being again and again, allowing it to become stronger a part of your sensory, somatic experience of yourself. And the next time that something feels too intense, that your own emotions feel like too much, notice this ground of being and feel it merging with your own gut, with your own ground. And lean into that experience of intensity, of something that seems like too much. Lean into it while 
remembering that you are standing on harmony, that harmony is stretching infinitely from your own gut. Let's spend three moments of silent meditation now. Stay with your gut as fully as you can and feel your gut, your base as the one ground beneath each of us. It is the true base of harmony holding and supporting all expressions at once. Very good, and now return to the sound of my voice. Return to the present moment, to your body, where you are sitting in your room, and allow your functioning mind to wake up gently and slowly, staying deeply connected with this sacred essence of universal harmony. This is the beginning of a real life experiential journey with healing the difficult traits of the type nine and helping them return home to their essence remembering again and again how to connect to your ground of harmony.